the Scottish warrior, the self-proclaimed chosen one, the number one contender, Drew McIntyre. You want to talk about destiny? Is tonight the night that Drew McIntyre fulfills the long-awaited prophecy and becomes the world heavyweight champion in front of a sold-out capacity crowd at the showcase of the Immortals. Drew McIntyre experienced loss, experienced failure, experienced defeat time and time again in 2022. But those losses, those experiences, have only made Drew McIntyre hungrier. They've only made the Warrior want this so much more. And Drew McIntyre outlasted five of SmackDown's best inside the Elimination Chamber to earn his spot in tonight's main event. WrestleMania Saturday for the World Heavyweight Championship. But no matter how much momentum McIntyre has, is anybody operating on a better level than the visionary, than the revolutionary, than the world heavyweight champion? Seth Rollins has been World Heavyweight Champion atop of Friday Night SmackDown for 78 days. He has not lost in WWE in 149 days. Since being the World Champion, Rollins owns victories over Buddy Murphy, Robert Roode, Dominic Mysterio, The Hurricane, Dexter Loomis, Jeff Hardy, Dolph Ziggler on two occasions, and he has pinned John Cena three separate times. Seth Rollins is a part of the best of the best, but the fact is he may be leading the pack as the absolute best. But tonight is where you prove it. Tonight is the big dance, and tonight, is for all the gold. Introducing the challenger from Air Scotland, weighing in at 254 pounds, Drew McIntyre. And introducing the champion, from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds. He is the World Heavyweight Champion, Seth Rollins! Ladies and gentlemen, it is main event time! February 25th, Raymond James Stadium, Tampa Bay, Florida, Wrestle Mania Saturday. And Friday Night SmackDown's best of the best are in the main event. McIntyre, Rollins. The bell has sounded and the world title's on the line. Who wants it more? We are gonna find out right here tonight at WrestleMania. McIntyre has been the WWE Champion. He defeated Brock Lesnar at WrestleMania for the gold on a night, on a WrestleMania in front of nobody, in front of no audience. McIntyre, people have wondered if he will crack under the pressure of finally making it back to the big stage and competing in front of 65,000 plus. But as mentioned in the video package beforehand, McIntyre is out tonight to prove his naysayers wrong and to prove his supporters correct. And Seth Rollins wasting no time looking to take out McIntyre off that middle rope Phoenix splash and fouls it over the knee. We mentioned the list of opponents Seth Rollins has defeated 
over the last number of months. We have said it time and time again. We are not sure if Seth Rollins, or I should say if anybody in WWE is operating on a better level than the visionary of WWE. You might not like Seth Rollins' cocky attitude. You might not like his actions sometimes, but there's no doubting his talents, no doubting his abilities, and no doubting that he absolutely hasn't earned every victory as the World Heavyweight Champion. McIntyre's looking to spoil that reign tonight, but Rollins wants to end this thing early, trying to take the wind out of the sails of McIntyre, but McIntyre gets the shoulder up. Seth Rollins has got to continue to just beat down McIntyre, take the audience out of this, take Drew McIntyre's hopes and dreams out of this, and pick apart the man like he has done to so many others. McIntyre avoiding disaster off that moonsault and a nice headbutt there. Drew McIntyre. And now pumbling away on Seth Rollins. He's gonna beat the piss out of the world champion tonight if he wants to leave with the gold. And he's looking to do just that as he sends Rollins for a ride. McIntyre is as hungry as I have ever seen him these last number of months. He wants this more than possibly anybody, but does he have what it takes to dethrone Seth Rollins? Rollins not even allowing a one count there as McIntyre whips him off, and a nice overhead throw by the Scottish Warrior. Now McIntyre going back again, just pummeling the world champion. We're gonna talk about Rollins trying to take the wins out of McIntyre's sails. McIntyre's trying to make sure Rollins can't make it to those deep championship rounds that he has thrived in throughout his reign. Oh, and Rollins with a ripcord knee on McIntyre. This has been pedal to the metal since the opening bell. This is what the main event of WrestleMania is all about, leaving it all in the ring and never looking back. Now Rollins going back to the top rope. McIntyre's down, frog splash by Rollins. Vintage visionary inside of the squared circle and I'll follow it up with a knee directly into the spine that may as well be right into the heart of Drew McIntyre. Trying to take McIntyre out of this matchup and Drew able to counter. Oh, goes for a shot there, but Rollins had a scout in McIntyre. I don't know if Rollins, is, if it's smart for Rollins, I should say, to throw haymakers with the Scottish Warrior. Oh, McIntyre with another hard shot. Falls over the kick, falls over the chop, goes for the headbutt, Rollins counters and sends the number one contender over the top rope. What a WrestleMania Saturday it has been thus far, and this is your main event of night one. We will be back tomorrow night for WrestleMania Sunday at 5 p.m. Eastern time. Another live premiere. You're not going to want to miss it. McIntyre grabbing Seth Rollins again and throws him into the ring apron. Rollins sent McIntyre to the outside originally, but I don't know if that was the best idea surrounding Drew McIntyre with the accessories at ringside. McIntyre... Knows he can't win via count out. Gonna head back into the ring after doing a little bit of punishment to the world champion. And now sending Rollins off, pulls him back in. Tilt to world backbreaker to the world heavyweight champion. Rollins has defeated everybody that has been put in front of him over the last couple of months on Friday Night SmackDown. Is Drew McIntyre gonna be the kryptonite, however? Or is Seth Rollins just better than anybody right now? This Seth Rollins truly operating on a different level than the rest of the WWE locker room. As we will find out in this main event. As Rollins looks to take the momentum back, goes for the kick to the gut, McIntyre counters, misses for a shot. Another hard-hitting chop. McIntyre's really throwing a lot of strikes tonight. Just trying to knock the wind out of Seth Rollins and add, let that punishment add up in the process. With them off there, Rollins is able to avoid whatever McIntyre had in mind, and Rollins drops him with the DDT. McIntyre has been in control the last few minutes, now gets a taste of his own medicine, as the world champion is unloading on the number one contender right now, and just pummeling Drew McIntyre in the corner in Tampa Bay. Stomping a mutt hole, if you will. The World Heavyweight Champion loving his own work 
as McIntyre's down the canvas. There's the kip up, goes for the clothesline, and absolutely takes off the head of Rollins. Back into the corner. Do not keep down, or not count out McIntyre, I should say, for very long. Squashes Rollins in the corner, now the reverse suplex. Letting Rollins eat the canvas and McIntyre to win the world title here at WrestleMania, not just yet. After everything McIntyre has been through over the last 365 days, he has worked so hard to get better, worked so hard to get back to this moment. He does not want to see the opportunity pass through his fingers tonight, and he's willing to do anything, even going off the top rope in uncharacteristic fashion. Rollins gets the shoulder up, but the damage has certainly got to be done after driving the elbow right into the sternum of the world champion. McIntyre again sending Seth Rollins over. Rollins able to hang on, but I don't think McIntyre, he's got an answer for every question Rollins is going to throw at him tonight. Or at least he better hope. McIntyre, oh man, go, he's going for a punt kick, it looked like there. And coming from a tree trunk leg the size of McIntyre, that would have took him out. Wait a minute. Curb stop. McIntyre's WrestleMania and world title dreams may have just gone up in smoke into the cover. The kick out. McIntyre with the kick out of the curb stomp. Does anybody want the world championship more? Does anybody want the moment more than the Scottish breathing son of a bitch and Drew McIntyre? McIntyre kicked out of Seth Rollins' best move in his arsenal, the curb stomp, and somehow the Scottish warrior is still breathing. Rollins muscles up McIntyre, and McIntyre face plants on the canvas again. Rollins heads back up. McIntyre kicks up. It would have trip up Seth Rollins, and Rollins goes down. Yeah. McIntyre, you smell the sense of urgency out of the number one contender. After the curb stop, he knows he's got to turn the gear up to 10 right now. Now Drew whips off Rollins. Shoulder block there. He's got to unload. He's got to give everything he's got to this matchup tonight. There can be nothing left behind. No holding back as he sits out into the cover. Will that do it to win the gold dead center of the ring? But Rollins still has fight left in him. Gotta wonder what the psyche of Rollins is right now. That curb stomp, usually the final now in the coffin. Not able to put McIntyre away just yet. Has Rollins blown a load already as McIntyre has got him on the top rope. Look at the strength of the number one contender. Down goes the champion from oh so high in the air. And McIntyre is still not done. Rollins on spaghetti legs, but there's a counter by the champion. World title's on the line. Rollins not looking to give an inch as he super kicks the nose of Drew McIntyre here. And Rollins in the corner. Well, McIntyre, you want to talk about days? Look no further than the number one contender. Behind the back, Rollins goes, and that may do it. After the curb stomp, plus a final blow to retain the world title. No, McIntyre survives again. Seth Rollins has got to be racking his brain right now as to what the hell he's got to do to keep down Drew McIntyre tonight. Rollins may be better than ever, but is Drew McIntyre just too motivated for anybody humanly possible to keep McIntyre down and out tonight? Rollins sends the big man over the top rope and sends him down to the floor off the snap off the top rope. Now Rollins gonna continue the fight, sends the world champion back in the ring after he takes that fall. Champ's going after him. There's a chop from Rollins. Rollins unloading him. The number one contender again. McIntyre kips up, grabs the champion, and sent, oh, sends him into the ropes. Rollins able to block it. Collar and elbow again here as McIntyre sends Rollins into the corner, and there's a boot again. McIntyre 
getting back in this matchup, trying to rally the crowd here in Tampa Bay, but he's got to keep his eyes on the world champion. And that misstep may have just handed Rawls the victory tonight here at WrestleMania. And in the cover he goes to retain the gold, McIntyre survives. McIntyre's got to keep his eye on the ball. He can't be rallying the troops right now. Tampa Bay is behind him. He's got to know that, and he's got to stay focused. And an elbow takes the champ off his feet, at least for a moment. Got to keep your foot on the gas, as McIntyre is stomping out the heart of the world heavyweight champion. Back into the corner goes Rollins. McIntyre putting him on the top rope. What has he got in mind here? Just ragdolls him off the top and Rollins takes a fall. And oh no, McIntyre's in the corner. If he hits this, it may be all she wrote. Claymore! To accomplish a lifelong dream. That's, no, Rollins kicks out. You've got to be kidding me. Seth Rollins survives. And the World Heavyweight Championship main event rolls on another moment. McIntyre shot his best shot at Rollins right there. The Claymore kick and somehow, some way, Seth Rollins survives. Rollins now on the apron, goes for the springboard, goes for the knee. McIntyre gets out of the way. McIntyre still finds himself with the upper hand, at least for the moment. Got to capitalize where the champion's weary. Who's got the intestinal fortitude to dig down deep, reach into their heart, reach into their soul, fight another moment, fight another minute, and walk away as the world heavyweight champion? Rollins is down right now. McIntyre continues to fight. Goes for the headbutt there. Rollins counters, but McIntyre with a counter. Goes for the haymaker, hits the kick. McIntyre unloading, another reversal by Rollins. Goes for the kick, another reversal by McIntyre, but Rollins hits the Insiguri. McIntyre pops up, swinging neck breaker by that Scottish breathing son of a bitch, Drew McIntyre. Rollins with another kick, but McIntyre will not stay down. Rollins is down on the canvas. McIntyre's wheels are turning. If he hits this, Claymore number two it will be. There it is. Will that do it? The dreams of Drew McIntyre have finally been realized. And the chosen one's prophecy has been fulfilled on the showcase of the Immortals. Holy hell, what a main event. Seth Rollins toppled them all, but he was not good enough to outlast the Scottish warrior, the man who just wanted it more. Drew McIntyre has accomplished a lifelong dream and is the new World Heavyweight Champion. Here is your winner, and the new World Heavyweight Champion, Drew McIntyre! We called it destiny, and destiny it was. Failure becomes triumph. Failure becomes victories. Failure becomes winning it all on the grandest stage of them all, 2022. Lesson learned for Drew McIntyre. 2023, destiny is fulfilled on the biggest night of Drew McIntyre's career. WrestleMania Saturday, one for the history books. And we're not done. We'll be back here tomorrow night, 5 p.m. Eastern time for WrestleMania Sunday. Face on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back. I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat. Gonna see me rise if you hate on that. I don't play both sides, don't need no cap. I'm a rock.